morning everybody how are we all doing hopefully everybody's having an amazing day i know it's been a little while since mama recorded and i apologize for that i've been concentrating on twitch a little bit more and also we have had um family problems to deal with um unfortunately my uncle passed very fairly recently after a fairly short six months or so battle with cancer so we have been dealing with that today is a completely different type of video for me because i have been dabbling with ant keeping for a while um inside here is my new queen i um i got a harvester ant probably a few years ago and i think i kind of messed up the hibernation thing and she ended up passing over the winter um so we didn't do a very good job of that i think maybe she got too cold or something like that so what i have done is i have a heat map here or a heat pad um for her to to be sat on top of if it gets too cold what i wanted to do with you guys is just show you the little queen there she is you can just see her moving around and i will move her up for you i don't want to disturb her too much i have had her about a week um she's got some chia seeds in there because as you can see can, can we get you to focus no she does have one worker in there with her and i have put some chia seeds in because we have got a worker who's going to need the protein and things this is how ants typically come when you get them from a, a breeder they will come in some water at the bottom here with the plug to stop the ant from drowning they will have a small amount of space because the queen would dig a very small burrow when she'd first mated um so it's to simulate it's to simulate those conditions and then obviously we stop her getting out here she will be moved to a bigger habitat once she has around 30 or so workers maybe a little bit less i'll probably move her into a bigger test tube at that point and keep her in the test tube for a little bit longer what i want to know from you guys is what are we going to call this queen and I know this is a short video, but I am not used to filming this close up. My setup is obviously crap. But um, just what are we going to call this queen? She needs a name. She is a harvester ant, so she, she eats mostly seeds. And to start with, we have got the chia seeds. I got these from not sponsored Davy Ants in the UK. Um, I have them shipped in. So I did, I did buy a, a, a tube of chia seeds at the same time. And then also... Once we get um, soldier ants and they get the jaws and they can crack the seeds open themselves, we can move them onto bigger seeds, right? So I bought a test tube of those as well. And I do know what the mix is in there so that I can replicate it for years to come. Um, but that amount of seeds will probably last them probably a good six months or even more because to start with, they're going to be a very small colony. Um, at the moment, I am crushing the chia seeds before I put them in, which is why it looks very dirty in there. It's not. It's just casings and things like that um when i move her to a bigger test tube we will get that cleaned up unless i think it needs cleaning beforehand in which case we're going to have to move her to another test tube anyway while i clean up um i am going to close her off now because she she doesn't like the light she wants to stay underground and be in her burrow so we're going to keep her in there um for a few more weeks at least i'm going to try not to disturb her too much but give me a name for my queen ant guys and i will keep you updated with regular um videos and stuff of what she is up to and i will see you all really really soon ciao for now guys Ciao, ciao.